Final walkthrough day. I wanna to talk to you about three important things that I look for when I am doing a final walkthrough in a home for a client. There's more than just three. So if you're working with me, we'll go through the rest of the lists. It may be based on what you ask for on the inspection. It may be just small things that came up along the way. But the top three things that I look for is electrical and make sure that all lights are shining. Plumbing, I go through and flush all the toilets and turn on all the sinks and the tubs and the showers and everything and make sure we have no unexpected leaks and make sure the plumbing actually works still, especially during the winter months when pipes could have frozen and anything and everything could happen. This is an important time of the year to actually check that double and triple check that plumbing. And the first thing, the most important thing of all is to make sure the house is still standing and make sure it hasn't blown away, make sure it has not, I don't know, burned down any of the above things. But those are the items that I look for when I come to do a final walkthrough, in addition to the inspection report and everything that my buyer may or may not have asked. If you're thinking about buying or selling, now's a great time. The market has not really slowed down in Raleigh, but you're able to get great prices for your house. Although you're paying a little bit higher on interest, you're still getting a great house for the money. And if you're out of the country, you need an agent that is used to this. My client today is actually out of town, able to go through the walkthrough, check off all the items, make sure everything is complete and make sure the house is in great condition. So that way, when you get back, you have a house to move into. Hope everybody has a great day. Don't forget to subscribe and follow.